Hey guys and welcome back to my YouTube channel. If you're new here, hey I'm Queen Shani B and if you're returning, what are you saying? So today I'm gonna do a sort of little haul. I don't know if you guys are gonna be into it but I thought let me show you guys anyway. Sort of like a growing collection of mine. Today I thought I'd show you my growing lipstick collection and it's actually mainly a Chanel lipstick collection. Today I just thought I'd show you the different colours that I have within the collection because you know, we haven't really been able to go anywhere this year. But my collection has still been growing. On the days where I have been able to go somewhere, I thought let me dress it up with a little lipstick, right? And let me put a little bit of colour into the face. Now earlier during lockdown, I did throw out a couple of my lipsticks, but those were ones that were so old that I hadn't used in years. So now this is the reviewed concise lipstick collection. As I've cut down on the amount of lipsticks that I have, I can officially say these are my favourite lipsticks right now. And I would have to say obviously these are my favourite Chanel lipsticks right now. So let me show you. Some of them are actually a little bit older. Um but yeah I'll let you know the names and everything. These are the babies. So you know my name is Chantel Queen Shani B is where it comes from. So we go from Chanel to Chantel. Chanel lipsticks are for me like some of the most long lasting lipsticks like I can wear them for almost the whole day sometimes you need a little top up it rubs off you know not fully rubs off but you might need to have a little touch up if you have like a little drink or just from wear and tear these days wearing the mask can, you can rub off but the Chanel lipsticks really do stay so let me show you what I've got so the first one I'm going to show you this one is a pink kind of colour uh this is this color is called rouge a la velvet number 42 as you can see it's literally the same color as my nails just a little tip actually use your thumb and literally just suck your thumb and it makes sure that you don't get lipstick on your teeth while you're out so this one i go for as like an inner lip look like i don't i'll put a lip liner maybe a darker something around i also have this one that kind of goes with it um and this is like a lipstick slash like lip gloss so this lip gloss goes with that other lipstick and it's just a gloss uh, which you can put over the lipstick and it makes it a little bit darker so this one is called the rouge Allure ink and it's number 146 it says say du son so if you don't really want the brightness of the actual pink lipstick which sometimes i don't i darken it up with this lip gloss on top of it really works but like with my, my skin tone a really bright color just doesn't really work for me other people might like it but on me i just don't like it being too bright also you can use them separately next on the list we have rouge coco dimitri which as you can see is a bit of a pinky red you can wear this if you're going to a meeting you can wear this if you're going to meet your friends you can wear this if you're going on a night out this color sweet is very very sweet i don't feel like it's too bright or too dark on me i love the color for my skin tone and i like a red uh, lipstick so a pinky red is just a little bit different but nice you know next up we have this is called rouge coco flash and as you can see the shape is a little bit different to the other ones this is a very moisturizing lipstick and it literally glides on i feel like it has a lot more slip so it doesn't i feel like it doesn't stay on for as long but the color is a bit of a brownish red it's like a sultry brown and i really really enjoy it It sort of matches this hair color that i have right now as well the other thing i really love about this lipstick is the packaging we've got like gold specks in the lid and i absolutely love that detail yes this color is beautiful so the next color we have rouge allure velvet extreme it's number 116 and it's called extreme so we be extreme in this beach. This is basically an extreme red. It's like a deep, deep red. Look at the redness. It's like the perfect redness for my skin color because it's not too bright. I really don't feel the bright, bright red colors on me. Some people like it on me, but I prefer the sultry. You know, when I was younger, I would go for the red, red, but now I go for the sultry red. This color is beautiful, especially for this time of year is coming up to Christmas. I'm gonna be doing up reds 
in your lipstick sometimes when you're heading out you've got on your red outfit santa claus outfit this is the color for you i'm telling you packaging is just sleek no gold it's just sleek black pop it in your bag cute so the final one that i have to show you today is this one which is more of a lip gloss this color is called rouge coco gloss number 754 it pairs with the last lipstick that i showed you extreme red so the extreme red is actually a matte lipstick um but this help you gloss it up a little bit as you can see it's christmas themed as you can see that red is strong this is giving you hours of wear look at how strong the red is jeez but this is definitely for if you're going out. You could wear it in the daytime, but people are going to be like, where is she going? If you want them to ask where you're going, and it stays shiny for hours, like. It give you gloss and red look and all the sultry that you want. Thank you guys for watching my video. Like, comment, and subscribe, and share with your friends. What lipsticks do you have? Do you have a little collection growing? Because I definitely do with the Chanel lipsticks and lip glosses. I don't even know how this started, but if you love Chanel and Chanel lipsticks and Chanel wear, give me a little like because Chantel has to be wearing the Chanel. Like.